Hello everyone welcome to back my channel I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Lindsay Chrysley was a hot topic when Savannah appeared as a guest on Nick Files podcast recently. Early on in the podcast, Nick made it clear he didn't know much about Savannah Chrisley's siblings. Savannah poked fun at him noting he should have done some research beforehand. After taking some time to process, Lindsay sat down for an episode of her podcast called Coffee Convos with Kylan Lowry to discuss all of the things her sister said about her. Lindsay admits she didn't really understand why she came up as a topic of conversation to begin with. Lindsay insisted she was happy with keeping family drama private, but her little sister opened the door, so she took the time to address what her sister talked about. Todd Chrisley's oldest daughter took issue with Savannah using her guest appearance on this podcast to trash her sister. She questioned why Savannah didn't use her own podcast to open up about how she was feeling. Lindsay argued it just didn't make sense not to use her own podcast to spill this kind of tea. Previously, Lindsay had made the decision to withhold exactly why she and her siblings were not speaking or following each other. Turns out she found a funny bingo card on Reddit that was trolling her family. She shared it on Instagram and tagged her siblings, again insisting she thought it was funny. Her siblings immediately tossed her in a group text and ordered her to take the bingo card down at once. Lindsay didn't understand why they were so bothered, she also didn't understand why they felt the need to attack her with a group text. Lindsay Chrysley fired a lot of shots at Nick, noting that her relationship with Savannah was none of his business. She called his line of questions very judgmental and crass. She also took issue with the accusation that Todd being locked up was harder on Savannah than it was on her. Lindsay continued, It shows just a complete lack of empathy, but also just a lack of awareness. You didn't have parents that were divorced or went through toxic co-parenting and hate each other. It doesn't mean that I didn't love Julie. And I said on a previous episode, she could have hung the moon, but she still wasn't my mother. Lindsay points out that it wasn't that long ago that the family did the crossover with their podcasts. And she doesn't understand how her sister didn't feel this way during the crossover, but feels this way now. Is Lindsay implying her sister is lying? On Reddit, fans were pretty quick to rip Chloe as a mouthy and disrespectful child. They added they were sad for Chloe as it was obvious Savannah was ruining her and any future she would have as a decent person. What did fans have to say about Chloe's recent appearance on Savannah's podcast? Keep reading for the details. Chrisley knows best fans were too horrified to enjoy getting an update on Chloe and Grayson during this week's episode of Savannah's podcast. With Todd and Julie behind bars and fans still waiting for the new reality TV show, the only updates fans get regarding Chloe are the ones Savannah shares. So fans were thrilled to see her as a guest on Savannah's podcast. Things however quickly took a turn when Chloe began to ooze sass and attitude while speaking. Ripping Chloe as mouthy fans were hugely turned off by the way Savannah allowed her to speak. Fans however added they weren't too surprised as she sounded just like Savannah. Sadly, most fans admitted they could only make it through 5 to 10 minutes of the podcast episode because of Chloe's attitude. One fan penned, I only watched for 9 minutes, and already I can tell you, Chloe has turned into such a mouthy little thing, and Savannah just laughs, God help this family. A fourth individual agreed that Savannah was not doing herself or her family any favors with her podcast episodes. On a more positive note, one fan did praise Chloe for being spunky. This, however, was the only positive comment on the entire thread. Overall, fans feared for the person Chloe would turn into by the time her parents out out of prison. Presently, Todd and Julie still face pretty hefty sentences, though they did get nearly two years shaved off recently, and their lawyer suspected their sentences would likely get reduced a second time soon. Do you agree with fans calling Chloe mouthy and disrespectful? Do you think Savannah Chrisley is ruining Chloe's future as a good person? Share your thoughts in the comments and keep coming back for more updates on the Chrisley family.